Welcome to Hack the Body, Hack the Mind. My name's Charlie and I'm going to be your coach for today. We're down at Origin Athletic and today we are going to go through the bodyweight squat. Yeah. Welcome to Hack the Body, Hack the Mind. Drive up and by KG. Now, the bodyweight squat, you may have seen it called an air squat, something like that. And we're going to go through a setup today and how I want you to actually perform this movement. It seems like quite a basic movement, but if you don't get the basics right, then we are going to be at a disadvantage from the start. So the first thing I want you to think about is your feet. Where do your feet sit? Now, your feet are basically going to go shoulder to hip width apart, okay? And it's going to be different to each and every person, so find your foot stance as you do it. There's going to be one that feels more comfortable to you. You may feel more comfortable going wider. You may feel more comfortable going narrower. What I don't want is your feet facing dead straight forward. I want them pointed out a little bit. So if you're on a clock face, we're looking at like five to one type thing. Once your feet are finally in a good position, this is where we can start our air squat. What I want you to think about is knees tracking your toes. So the ways your toes are pointing, that's the way I want your knees to point. So what we do is we take a big breath in, we peel our shoulders back and we keep a nice neutral spine throughout this whole movement. What I want you to think about is keep your eyesight looking either dead straight or look up a little bit. If we look down, we're more likely to go down. I like to send my hands and my knees over my toes as I squat. So this way I can kind of open up a gap in front of me. You'll see a lot of people squat quite narrow with their feet forward and what seems to happen is everything's all forward and back. What I want you to do is try and get to parallel or what we like to call below 90 degrees. If you can't, then only squat where you feel comfortable. And each and every time you can try and go a little bit lower and a little bit lower. If you don't feel safe doing this, then what you can always do is put a box behind you and you can squat down to the height of the box. That may make you feel a little bit safer when you do this. This has been Hack the Body, Hack the Mind. I'm Charlie. You can find us on all different social media platforms. Thank you for tuning in and we'll see you on the next one.